Hello everyone, welcome to a new video. Today I'm going to show you another cheap Bluetooth speaker from Silvercrest. Uh, this one costs uh, $11.75, so basically $12. But for the price you get a pretty decent quality built speaker. Here you, on the back you can see the specifications. You can pause the video and read them if you want. Okay, so without further ado, let's get it out of the box. Now, I should mention that I did uh, open the box prior to making this video because it's kind of difficult to get the speaker out of the out of the packaging. Okay. Now, inside the box, you get the manuals and the instruction manuals in different languages you get the speaker itself okay you get a micro usb charging cable And a 3.5 millimeter auxiliary cable for non Bluetooth devices. Now let's take a look around the speaker. On the bottom, you have the on on off switch. Here's the charging port. Here's the microphone, LED indicator volume up and down, skip reverse tracks, play pause, answer and end phone calls. Yes, you can use it to answer and end phone to answer and end phone calls. Okay, so let's power it up. You can see, you can see the LED indicator is blinking. It's automatically in pairing mode. So let's pair up with the phone and see how it sounds. Okay. Let's use Bluetooth. You can see it here. All right, it's paired. Pretty easy. Okay, so let's give it a shot. See how let's hear how it sounds. That is max volume on the Bluetooth speaker itself. So, let's go. Let's get max volume on the phone too.
well, as you could hear, it sounds pretty decent given the price for only $12. You can't expect to have uh, a great sound quality or a great build quality, but it is pretty sturdy. It's, it is not a water resistant speaker, so you will damage it if you if you get it out in the rain or if you use it outside when in uh, wet conditions but other than that it's pretty decent it's a pretty cheap speaker for people who don't want to spend a ton of money on those you you're not gonna be too concerned if it breaks or you can decide I don't know to get it open see what's inside of it maybe use it for parts or whatever it is you want to do with it okay well that's enough for now uh, thank you so much for watching and we'll see you in the next video alright see you